Hey guys, just another quick video. I'm showing today my um, uh, CSE826 uh, Super Micro server chassis. This is what I'll be doing my home server in. Um, so it's a 2U case, uh, fits up to uh, EATX, or uh, motherboards, I actually think it'll fit Super Micro EEATX. That's kind of um, a proprietary size they use. I'm not sure if any other server companies use the same size, but I got the motherboard mounted here. Um, as you can see, it's uh, pretty big. Uh, I added these uh, brackets here. That'll fit up to three uh, two and a half inch bays. because that's one thing it is lacking is uh, any space for internal drives. Uh, I replace the um, factory fans with these Arctic uh, 80 millimeters. Uh, they don't move as much airflow, but they are um, a lot quieter. Um, I, I do have them facing towards the hard drive because I'll be mer vertically mounting this case. So normally you'd have them blowing um, that way out towards the back. Um, and I am going to add some um, uh, different coolers that actually blow air this way. So that should help as well. Um, it has uh, 12 hot swap bays. I currently just have one in there, but they fit uh, three and a half inch bays um, and they hook up to uh, the SAS2 backplane. Um, I'll do another video kind of going over that. But uh, along with that, you also have the um, dual um, uh, power supplies. So if one fails, the other one uh, will kick in. Now, if one fails or one kicks in, this thing screams really loud. So you're definitely not going to uh, miss that uh, when one does go bad. Uh, so yeah, I got the motherboard mounted like this. It just has um, a seven uh, low profile brackets. Uh, I'm still missing the IO shield. I got one coming from China. Unfortunately, this motherboard did not come with one, but a uh, pretty good case. It uses Super Micro's uh, proprietary connector like this. So, you know, this should plug right into the motherboard as long as you're using a Super Micro motherboard. But you can go online on eBay or Amazon and get a special connector. Um, that breaks this out if you're using a different motherboard brand. But So pretty good case. I like it. Um, it is a little heavy, but um, I guess you're going to come to expect that when working with server hardware. But, you know, I really like this case, and um, I think it'll fit me well. It's nice. It's going to be nice to have the hot swap bays because that was kind of a pain when doing my old home server. If the hard drive uh, went down or needed to change one, I had to take half the computer apart where this literally takes, you know, three seconds. So you're definitely going to enjoy that. But uh, let me know if you guys have any different. Additional questions. Thanks. Bye.